Hello friends, in our last lecture we have seen that how we can install key clock on our local machine. In today's lecture we will see how we can create roles, users and RAMs using the key clock administration console. So uh, let's uh, open the key clock administration console, open your favorite browser and type localhost and uh, port on which you installed your key clock uh, server and then auth uh, press enter uh, here we have administration console click on administration console uh, this is uh, our administration console and by default rims created by key clock is master basically master uh, reams is used by the administration and you must create your own reams uh, in master ream the main purpose of the master reams is so that you can create multiple reams in master reams master reams is just only used to administrate other reams so uh, we create our first rams click on add ram button uh, the name is only required field to create ram so uh, here uh, we name it demo so our first ram is demo click on create button so uh, this is uh, main page of our first created ram which is demo so we can create roles in our uh, demo ram click on roles uh, these these are the roles created by key clock by default so you can create your own role click on add role button uh, role name is a required field so we create our first role name is user click on save button so uh, our first role is created successfully now uh, we can create uh, users uh, click on users uh, view all users so there is uh, no user we have created yet uh, click on add user button uh, username is only required field over here uh, let's create test user so this is the test user uh, click on save button uh, here we have credentials uh, tab uh, in which we can create password of the newly created uh, user so password uh, of the uh, newly created user is up to you whatever you want to like test uh, and test uh, temporary uh, this uh, actually uh, uh, field is used to make sure this password is temporary or uh, permanent if you uh, if you set it temporary uh, if you off it it means this user will provide uh, his uh, password after first login so uh, I am making it temporary set the password and set so now we can log in uh, uh, by uh, this user so uh, just go to log out from admin and open new tab press uh, yeah we have uh, rams then demo ram we created uh, right now and account press enter so uh, here we have sign in button uh, click on it provide the username uh, as uh, we know we have created our user with username test and password is also test click on sign in so uh, you can see the temporary uh, uh, field when we created the user so here we must uh, reset the password of the newly created user so you can 
reset it and submit so this is uh, the main uh, page of the test user here you can provide uh, personal information of test user email first name and then last name and click on save so guys you can uh, create multiple users multiple roles uh, using the uh, key clock administration uh, console so you are ready to secure your application uh, by using key clock so thank you thank you so much in the next video we will see how we can secure our uh, application by using key clock thank you